Hey guys, welcome back as always, my name is Lazar, and today on the menu we got update 33.5, the 7 crimes of Kulervo. And as the update suggests, we are going to be getting Kulervo, which is a brand new Warframe. He is a, well, he looks like a Roman-inspired Warframe. He's got knives sticking out of him, and today we got some gameplay. Apparently he's going to be locked up in some Colosseum-looking jail, and there you, wielding the Drifter, sadly, will get to fight Kulervo. The 7 crimes of Kulervo, essentially you're going to be going through each crime and kind of fighting the Warframe and that's going to be under the form of an event that you can access via Duvidi which is absolutely fantastic honestly I love this kind of approach when it comes to introducing a brand new Warframe so essentially you're going to get yourself Kulervo's Island that you get to explore as the drifter you go there you do this little quest it's cool or subjectively speaking of course it looked cool on the dev stream thumbs up for that so this is a new island that will appear and it's going to be yours to explore. There's lots of secrets within. Uh, so I'm going That's to beautiful. show you a handful of them today. I love it. It has as you can this imagine, very dark JLS feel that they went for. It, I think they nailed it. On this, uh, I think the atmosphere looks island. amazing. It's, almost yeah, as it's though pretty bleak. It's pretty yep. <laughs> you know, different states of accepting his fate. Ah, I the see. the seventh one where his fate was pretty sad. Yeah, he's, he's, not, <laughs> he's not doing so hot. And so, yeah. <laughs> Each of these cells houses Kalervo, and it's up to you to, you know, learn about the seven crimes, especially this one. Uh -oh. <laughs> yep. <laughs> <laughs> so you'll be fighting uh, Kalervo. Let me just get him. And then as you progress through the fight, depending on the mood, these Kalervos are going to come out of their prison to take you on. Uh, in this case, because we're in Soro, we're going to be dealing with an elementally cold Kalervo. So these attacks will start doing freeze damage. And we'll have, uh, you know, this is sort of a three-stage fight. And I'm not going to do them all because, you know, I'm not able to because I'm not good enough at the video game. <laughs> That's the main can't reason. Can't stabby the stabby. I can't. He's too powerful. It's kind of stab. focus blow. Is I that a heavy attack or just some kind of Kalervo focus blow thing? Shield. What collect, shield? Collect it all. Okay, okay, so the backstab. Teleport oh. into Rain of Knives. Here we go. Yeah, what? Or into e spam. Yeah. Oh, dear. Shield. That's Ooh. a fan of knives. Cool. Oh, God. <laughs> cool. Anyway, so here we have the Kalervo encounter. And then as you're playing, you'll be able to get um, the reward at the end of this day, at the end of the Kalervo fight, which will give you the ability to actually build Kalervo. Uh, Kalervo uh, node that will be there for two weeks. And after that, if you just want to do it, he'll be present in three of the moods and you can find him whenever you want in those, either if he's part of the, of the main path or you can just uh, play him aside from from the path next up on the list gauss deluxe oh my god the kreshnik the kreshnik the Kr I'm, I'm not sure how you pronounce this one but i tell you what the artwork was done by takaya lee he is a artist that is exactly tailored to my style i love his work and the skin looks absolutely insane it is mecha x hermes you get how that one would work thankfully you don't need to get it because we got actual footage it looks absolutely fantastic however we didn't get to see it in its full glory because the accessories and the skin itself didn't have the flaming effects that you get to see on the brand new Exeltra skin, which is essentially in the same vein as the Gauss skin. I cannot wait to get my hands on these. You know, skin reviews are not really a thing, are they? Because they are subjective. However, I might make an exception for this one. Huge thumbs up for the deluxe skin for Gauss. New decrees. We're going to be getting ourselves 15 new decrees, if I remember correctly, from Pablo. Some of them will be corrupted decrees yes my friends just like corrupted mods that take away a little bit of something from you but also add a bit of something a whole lot of something we're gonna be getting ourselves some corrupted decrees apparently these will be more special dominus frax will taunt us and say things about us and our mamas and all of that good stuff and we'll get angry and poon them so essentially the same thing we always do i love to see more decrees 15 plus the 108 we already got is gonna bring that up to 123 next up static undercroft portals now the way they describe these is an alternate path to farm arcanes which is absolutely fantastic essentially you're gonna be running yourself the duvidi experience steel path normal whatever you want and then you're gonna be going into these static portals that apparently are gonna be a whole lot more difficult and that's how we're gonna be able to consistently farm these new arcanes which again is fantastic we didn't get to see any actual gameplay to see the modifiers how tough the enemies are is this gonna be the new end game because you know up until a while ago farming eidolons well when farming eidolons was actually hard was the end game because you wanted to get the arcanes i'm wondering if they're trying to do the same thing with these static undercroft portals i'm all for it and i cannot wait to jump right into it you will uh have all these portals open and you won't be able to go in them 
<laughs> They're open, but you cannot go in. Until you have seven, <laughs> Just until you have seven <laughs> decrees. Pet. Speaking of arcanes, we are going to be getting new arcanes. And while they didn't show what the new arcanes are, it's nice to know that they are still adding to the game and to the overall experience. And finally, more Tenogen. Now, they're not going to splurge like they did in the past. They're not going to be doing waves. Essentially, Tenogen nowadays is going to be a constant stream. And they showed off a little bit of something. And I do believe, my friends, that is pretty much it. The last topic is going to be Wisp Prime. Prime. And how she looks. And, of course, the fantastic Fullman Prime. Honestly, the weapon looks amazing. I cannot wait to try it out, to test it. Wisp Prime. Here we go, boys. Oh, look at that. Look. Let's see. No look. one guessed. No one guessed. Wisp Prime. Oh, no look at the Fullman Prime. <laughs> oh. oh. Of course they knew. <laughs> looks nice. So yes. she's coming in our uh, future future Sick. update. Not part of Seven Crimes of Clairvaux at all. But if, if you like the way she looks, if you don't like the way she looks, that is entirely subjective. From my humble point of view, she seems a little bit overdone done even in her base form it looked like she had this like default siandana even though she comes with a siandana in the prime axis there's all sorts of stuff dripping around the back which shouldn't be and you know exactly why my dear friends honestly i was expecting more from wisp prime but hey at least we get that fantastic weapon and i cannot wait to bring you fantastic people a review but i do believe my friends that is pretty much it as always my name is belazar thank you guys so much for watching like favorite channel subscribe only if you enjoy the content man i'll catch you guys in the next one Bye bye. What melee she's getting? Why don't we take a look at oh, the concept yay, melee. first? Mm -hmm. Oh, what a fan! Oh, yeah, what a so fan! We are doing the Gunson Prime for Wisp, hey. and I'm gonna give that an Akita. Mm? That should look sexy. Not bad. Mm -hmm. I'm just typing quickly. Come on, I'm trying to be excited for melee. Help me out here. What's that sword? Okay. What's that sword? Can I not type? Do we recognize that sword with that skin? You did warn us there was a lot of time. I think I know ah, it. Here we go. I think I know it. So they look oh, incredible. That's beautiful. They look rad. I feel yeah, the wisp super, herself super cool. is a bit a overdone though. I my lights on here, so just bear Wait, with me. A little too much gold. A little too much, the, a little uh, yeah, too so much, too much. In incredible. She's got her beautiful war yes. fans that are primed. I love so the Warframe. I love the way they looks so and the animations cool. for Warframe fans. She just looks incredible. The so Wisp players will be eating good when oh, Wisp. Here we go. Here we go. Launches. Now we're, we're now we're not getting at it, Rebecca. That's oh, that's sure good. That's game. good design. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Cut through it. Funny. And then we also have the Cyan Dana. I don't think it's gonna help. Oh yeah, there it is. It's too long. It's got the little emissives at the end. Wait, is that part of the Siandana or nice is part gold, of Wisp? Gold, gold little witch. It seems like it's she's got That's she's like she one is. of those snails so and she's, she's carrying her us, house on uh, her later back. Later this summer after the Calervo updates, so let's get a closer look at her uh, yeah. prime Siandana. Really and there's actually another accessory coming. I don't we know, guys. Sandana how do you feel about this? The off operator slash drifter. It's a cosmetic, yeah. so it's so subjective. But lots still. of good stuff coming with her. You don't like it. I'm gonna show you the drifter suit on my Minecraft. So. For Miss Wisp Prime, this is the Drifter suit. So here you can see the incredible. This feels like Loki. Does yeah. this feel like Loki concept. to you guys? It's very yes. much like a like a source, like a. I like this one. Cauldron. I think this is like, cool. I love it. Don't you guys so think this? I like this. This is cool. Very mage-esque, very sorceress, very sorcerer. Yeah. This is the male body. I'm using a male Drifter these days. So yeah. this is. I think the, that's. I think that's nice. This is the back. I really do. The hip is so cool. I like to yeah, see the hip it has like that, like dangling cloth. Yeah. Internet.